gonna go on a little exploration to see the flamingos and the alligators. That girl can run like nobody's business. <laughs> Look at her go. Flamingo Island. Wow. Watch as the male flamingo goes in for the kiss of the female flamingo. Look at that. Look at those two right there doing the little bird dance. The ones right there doing their necks together. The smooth nature. A peck on the cheek. Stand on one leg. Every time I see a flamingo, I think of Aladdin. Where is this? Ali. Oh, Ali. Where are you? Out here in the menagerie. Hurry. <laughs> Get that boat. Stone's got them all memorized. We've got a drama, a little drama fest just happened. We've got the alpha flamingo is coming. Somebody trying to be cutting in. This is one of the five species of flamingos known to man. This particular breed is called the Caribbean flamingo. They eat crustacean creatures, shells and other things. In sewage water, the Caribbean flamingo is considered omnivorous since it can feed on seeds and algae, mollusks, larvae, crustaceans and gastropods. Their regular height is between 37 and 57 inches. They can reach sexual maturity between two and three years of age. They have been known to live up to 27 years in the wild and up to 50 years in captivity. Amazing! The most distinguishing characteristic of these beautiful birds is their beak, which has this little chamber that is made for separating silt and mud we are so blessed to see this creature live today. They are making the mating sound as we speak. This is magnificent! Here we are at the coveted Crocodile Lagoon, where the crocs are. But we can't see them, we need a little bit of bait. So I am going to merely take Squishy and dangle her body. And with a gait that comes to jump and get her, I will pull her out of the water. Watch me demonstrate this. Yeah! Look at the Johnson family, how they protect the young. They will not let the predator throw her into the alligators. This is a sign of family unity. This young one, Boeing, will be a prize for the fall harvest. Look at the muscles he's built in his legs. He's so protective. This child actually believes that I would dangle my baby over for a gator. That's what kind of parent they think I am. What does that say about me, honey? It means you are a carnival. <laughs> what is it, Squish? Iguana. Iguana. I love you. I want a million of those in my yard. This iguana has crawled all the way up the palm tree. We're in an iguana hunt right now. We're finding tons. Oh, hello, homeboy. Here's the one that Boeing found. He's only yours if you catch him. I see the dinosaur. Oh, two dinosaurs. And a bird. Two dinosaurs and a bird. They're big enough to be dinosaurs around here, aren't they, baby? Look at the big one Squishy just found. You found a big boy. I see the dinosaur. Holy cow, look at those fingernails. They're so cool. I love the iguanas. Outdoors. Outdoors. Whoa. Hey, big papa. Look at all the baby ones. Oh, even baby alligators are. Well, they're actually not that cute. Oh, well, they're so still. Hey, Brighton. Tell me about gators. Yeah. No, I mean, tell me what you know about I, gators. I know about. Okay. okay. This one thing. If anything touch any, any. A drop of sweat. Anything. A leaf. Water, okay. If it touches their top, its mouth closes. It automatically closes, no matter what. Even if they don't want to. That's right. It's a it's like a and what do you know about when their mouth shut? 
Okay, this is a homeschool moment. If you want to keep an alligator's mouth shut, all you have to do is barely hold it shut and it cannot open it. It has no force going this way. Only force going this way. But these are crocodiles, not alligators. Oh, isn't it the same difference? No, they are different. Uh, that's why I should not be teaching our kids biology. Squishy, do you want to ride the crocodile? You want to go give him kisses? Of course, she observes the crocodiles, but does not care. She sees the fish. The fish. Oh, Mary! Oh, oh, oh. Daddy! 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 Comes in because he sees a snack at the gate. A squishy snack. No. We found the gate and it's unlocked and we're going in. Jerry! Is it scary? That's a crocodile. Keep up! Keep up! But these ones close to you, you don't like so much, do you? They were fun to look at from afar, but then you saw them really close, and that was pretty scary. Can you give it a kiss? Oh, that's so scary! Oh no, not a poor little one! Brooklyn touch you while you were looking at the scary? A real baby, a very baby. Where? He's like the same size as an iguana. Brighton, is that you? Yeah. <laughs> Rose, it smells terrible. It's almost worse than daddy's breath.